What's up, y'all? Welcome back to the channel. It's your boy Flex and Rue. If you guys are new to the channel, please hit that subscribe and notification bell as always. So right now, today's video, I just got the phone call to pick up my car from the body shop. So, that, so that's what we're up to right now. I'm excited. Man, I really haven't got to drive my car in damn near like a month or two just because it's been in the shop so much. So they said it's ready to go. Um, I'm ready to go. I'm excited. Even during this quarantine and lockdown, I really don't have nowhere to go. But at least I can still cruise around and drive around and just stay distance from people, which I'm going to be in my car. But yeah, so I'm excited. You guys stay tuned. Let's see how it is. And uh, for you guys that are new to this channel that don't know what happened to my car, I got hit by this old lady. Um, it was her fault. So her, her insurance covered it. All my um, my body work that's been done to it, she hit the back uh, right end of the car, you know, on the right side. So just got some body shot right now. Right here, Lisa. Go in and get my keys. Be good to go. Check out the car. Guys, I just had to get all the stuff out the rental car. Put it in my, my baby right here, man. Then we're gonna drive it, make sure everything's good. They just waxed it and uh, detailed it really good. So let me get one of these keys. Hey, here goes the rental car keys. Yeah. All right, thanks. Thank all right, bye. bye. So here we go, picking it up. They detail it really good. They put a uh, wax on it. Looks really shiny, nice. So now uh, I'm gonna go home, put these tire stickers on. I'm gonna change those ones because I got a whole new set of tire stickers. So take those ones off, put the uh, new ones on. That's my next thing and make sure my alignment and everything's good. So this is my first test drive. Let's get it, y'all. See how it goes. Canisos is a really good spot to take your car at in Sacramento. If you guys ever got par car problems. There we go. Here is great with communication. The service advisors, the manager here at Canisos Body Shop. So I would highly recommend you guys, if you guys um, in Sacramento, if you get in a car accident or work done, come to Canisos. They're really great with communicating. And um, that's very important, especially with them having your car and just dealing with your car. So um, yeah, I would give them a five stars and they made sure my car was back to how it was before the accident. So I'm very pleased. So for right now, I just came downtown to take the car for a cruise, make sure it was all good, everything was cool. So far, it's good. In a week from now, after driving it and stuff, I'm going to take it back to my body shop. They're going to lift it up to see under the uh, where the axle where it was leaking at last time, make sure it's not leaking. So that's a week from now. But other than that, yeah, we're downtown right here during this quarantine, during this lockdown. Um, you see nobody's around here on South Dixon scene. But, you know, I'm just driving around cruising. Ain't nothing else to do. I've been reading, playing video games. That's what I've been up to. Uh, been spending a lot of time with family. But yeah, it's back in motion, you know, because everybody look at the car when they drive by. But let me know what you guys think. They did an awesome job as far as the body shop. And um, it took plenty of times just to get this car right. And, it, and it's, so far right now, it's good. So I'm going to continue to cruise around, go back to the house, chill, eat, all that good stuff. All right, good morning, world. You know, this is the next day. I didn't get to finish uh, the tires and all that for that day yesterday for picking up my car. So I got to go to Home Depot, get the uh, acetone to wipe down my tires, put my tire stickers on. But I came to West Sac right here to my grandma's house to um, basically pick up these, this paperwork for my dad. You know, if you guys don't know, I, I don't think I never said this story, but I want to tell you guys the story that my, you know, my dad's in prison for, uh, you know, he, they gave him 45 years. You know, he has some criminal history and all that. But other than that, yeah, you know, we're just trying to peel his court case. And um, at the end of the day, that's my dad, whatever. So um, family's family, blood is blood. So as uh, long as they do you right and you could forgive and hold no grudges, I'm going to fight for my dad as far as the system. So that's what we got going on right now. Oh, this paperwork from all the courts and trials and appeals and stuff like that. You know, this is pretty dope. He made this in prison. He drew this. Family is all Niner fan. I'm kind of like the only Raider fan, but you know I like all teams when it's in Kelly, but you know specifically the Raiders and the Niners. I gotta say, but yeah, it's pretty dope. What you guys think? But yeah, so we have to take all this, um, pick this box up from my grandma's house, and I took it to the lawyers. That way they can look at it and review it.
yeah, right now we're probably we're gonna head to Home Depot, grab this acetone for my tires, for my tire sticker so I can put it on today. And then we're gonna grab some food after that and then just call it a day from there. All right, y'all, we just got to Home Depot. The line's lightweight long, but I guess they're letting a certain amount of people in at a time due to this uh, coronavirus. So yeah, we're gonna go up in here, get this acetone and be on our way. on the acetone right here we're gonna get a little small can i need to get some sandpaper so it's eight bucks for a can right here at home depot then we just gotta get this sandpaper find the sandpaper next Let's see. we got the sandpaper we got 150 that's what they recommended medium light then the acetone then we are on our way so yeah, we right here just, just get some chicken nuggets and some french fries and be on our way to the house. And I'm gonna wait until later on when it cools down. That way I can apply these tire stickers onto my tires. Cause I already got the acetone and the sandpaper. So I'm gonna just wait till it cools down cause it's kind of hot. And I'm dressing these warm ass clothes. Cause this morning, like I said, I woke up this morning at seven and it was cool. Uh, it's starting to warm up. So I'm gonna change out of these clothes and just chill, um, kill some time and wait for the sun to go down so I can apply these tire stickers. That's where we're at right now. And the car's been driving fine. You know, it hasn't given me no problems yet. And hopefully it don't. But it's been driving really good. So, all right, you guys, we're about to start on these tire letters. We're going to clean off the tire, add these letters to it. I got everything ready. Rag, my sandpaper, and some acetone. Oh, shit. Lucky that's clean, closed. Acetone. Then I got the tire stickers right here. Now I got these gloves as well that came with the tire stickers. So, yeah, we're just going to clean off this tire right now this rag and put this acetone on the rag so we're gonna get this acetone put it on the rag and just scrub around the whole tire and get all that residue off or it's getting dark outside so i'm not sure if i'm gonna finish the rest i could do it tomorrow morning but anyways yeah uh this is how far we are we got the first one on we got to do the other side right here the bottom then yes yeah, so we got this one then just one more tire to go coming out nice what's up y'all welcome back so i just finished up the tire letters it actually really really time consuming to do all four tires to do it right to stick it right you know uh, to make sure the glue and it's just, whatever you see that's incorrect make sure you correct it like fast because it the glue will dry it fast but we just got done with these i worked on it last night it started to get dark so i just finished it today this morning um but yeah it's all said and done i think i did a great job for the first time you know first time doing this i think i did a really good job as far as everything being mounted right glued on right you gotta let them sit for like two hours well really an hour but i just let it sit for uh, an extra hour just to play it safe so yeah i got the needle tires so we're gonna go get this baby you're gonna go to the car wash and get it washed up right now that's what we on right now you guys i drove on the freeway i probably drove about like probably 10 to 15 miles so far and this is how the stickers are holding up still solid these are the stickers are holding up so we're gonna pick up some cbd tea you know it's really good for your body and um, your mindset as well you know you got to treat your body good so that's where we at right now so this is what the cbd oil is extra strength that keeps you calm the CBD oil. I think it's the essential oil, but there's no THC in it. They mix it in your tea. But it's more relaxing, you know, instead of getting high, you know, everybody got their own journey, what they want. So it's pretty cool. How they got this running in the store. All this stuff is good for your body, man. All these products benefit something. This cool little store right here in West Sacramento. If you guys are ever in Sacramento, come check it out. It's on alkaline water too. Pretty much everything. By the way, this tea is so good. Really good flavor. Um, it ain't too sweet. It ain't too strong. It's just, just perfect. So like I said, come try this spot out. It's um, alkaline water and salt in here at West Sacramento. Try out the tea. They got great water, great products. So I came to put some gas in, probably head to the grocery store. I gotta get some um, seasoning. I wanna make some chicken wings today, barbecue some chicken wings. That's been on my mind, so that's where we at right now. Just at this gas station, then head to the grocery store. 
All right, y'all, gas is super cheap right now due to this virus, so I just fill this baby up. Every chance I get, it's, uh, how much is it here? It's 2.29, you know, for the Supreme, for the 91, and it's 2.09 for the 87, so, but I had to put Supreme in here. All right, you guys, I'm done putting in gas right now, so I'm gonna head to the grocery store. I wanna get some seasoning because I wanna make some Cajun chicken meats. That's been on my mind lately on the barbecue grill. So that's what we're gonna make. That's what we're off to right now. All right, y'all, we just got to the store. I'm looking for the seasonings right now. So this is what we're rolling with, y'all. This is what I got. All spices. Oh, I forgot this one as well. Right here. I got one, two, three, four, five, six. So this is what we're rolling with. So we got four, five, six spices. Damn near $40 for that. All right, y'all, this is how my wings came out. Cajun. Always be running good so i really do appreciate you guys that's been on this journey with me in this vlog today and just in general everybody that's tuned into this video and um, subscribe to my youtube page and by the way we hit 17,000 subscribers in cameron so you know big celebration and uh, I'm, I'm making another video on a giveaway on what should i do for that so until then yeah i just appreciate you guys it's been a blessing it's been a journey and i'm thankful and i love you guys you know like i said i wouldn't be able to do this without you for all my youtube subscribers so you know continue to like the videos continue to drop comments um you know let me know what you guys think ask questions you know i get a lot of questions i'm actually really good at getting back to the questions usually late night when i lay down i usually go through all the comments and just read it today so it may take a couple days but i always get back to the comments and so that's what i've been doing just during this quarantine so for, yeah so hopefully everybody's safe during this quarantine time hopefully everybody's good and just prayers out to everybody and just play it safe for you guys so please subscribe to this channel if you guys are new please like this video drop comments what you guys think of the car and what you think of this vlog you know i make these vlogs for you guys i enjoy sharing my moments and sharing my journey with you guys you know put on camera because it's a lot carrying the camera around and just recording every moment and just you know it's just kind of day in the life anyways yeah please like this video drop comments below let me know any questions what you guys think about this video and like i said thank you guys for 17,000 subscribers and i'll see you till next time y'all peace